So Ron Mill and Nick Chularakis, Real Talk Boxing, congratulations on the fight. Thanks, man. So we were talking about the sixth round before, mm -hmm. and uh, you were talking about your kickboxing drills as far as absorbing damage, working yeah. on your defense, letting a guy punch himself out a little bit. Yeah. Was part of that playing possum a little bit? Were you legitimately rocked during that no, sixth no, round? No, no, thank God. I was never really rocked, but like I, told my, I told one of the guys in the back before, I think, when Emily was reporting, I said it's kind of like there was sometimes you kind of got to let go. And kind of just go with the movement, kind of take the shots. So there's times when I'm catching my wing, I kind of just go with the movement. Kind of, kind of like, you know, whatever. And then as my stamina come back, I get my wing back, then I come back, back on full force. But thank God, I was never really hurt any good, any shots. Um, you know, I seen everything, but sometimes I couldn't react the way I wanted to. But like I said, it's a great rush my first fight back, and I had a lot of fun, man. You know what I mean? I seen, I seen shots coming. I was like, okay, I got hit with that one. I hit with that one. Okay, time to hit him back, you know? But it was fun, like I said, man. It's boxing, learning experience. 11 months off, so back, you know, back to work. Also, you're looking to load up on some big shots, but you're mm -hmm. also keeping your punch output high. Yeah. As far as seeing opportunities, do you just look to put punches together, or are you looking to get one clean knockout shot? And, you know, sometimes you try to try to go for one clean shot, but I noticed after about, I think I threw a couple wild shots, but my, my leg was like left behind. And I say, you know what, I don't get caught in nothing crazy. Let me just pity pat him a little bit and drop some bombs in there. And um, you know, it worked out. Like I said, you know, I told guys, I mean, just about two or three rounds, we adjust. I can adjust the guys pretty well for a big guy. And um, that's what it came down to, it, man. Just adjusting, you know, like I said, mentally being a killer, but having fun at the same time, you know. And once you're having fun and you're just looking and you'll see stuff, man, it'll come to you. Um, What's about Dylan White? Didn't I ask you about that? Um, yeah, nobody did ask me about Dylan White. He's so 